Hey, it's Spencer from Mother Nature's Aquatics, and I'm going to explain our uh, aquaponics part one. Like I explained in the intro video, there are many different types of aquaponic systems. Each system uses a different technique to grow your plants, but achieves the same goal. These systems have a scientific explanation on how plants grow way better than soil. To go more in depth, we're going to start with a DWC, which stands for Deep Water Culture System. And then in a later video, I'll explain more challenging setup like a flood and drain system. So the way the Deep Water Culture System works is that a plant grows in a net pod filled with clay pebbles and then the roots are immersed in a nutrient-rich solution like our aquarium water. Also, the roots of the plant are consistently being provided oxygen by the air stone in the aquarium. The way I like to explain why plants grow so well in a DWC system is that when a plant is grown in soil, it's always spending plant energy on the roots to constantly search through the soil for nutrients to absorb when needed. So all that extra energy is put into the plant growth and that's why plants grow so much faster and larger in hydroponic style setup or in this specific case a deep water culture system. The materials you will need for a DWC system are net pods which come in many different sizes so I have a few here I'm going to show you as an example. You can also get uh, net pod lids like this one here. They uh, fit for five gallon buckets. We're not going to be using buckets right now, but uh, that's another quick example of uh, all the different variations net pods can come in. But again, we're going to be mainly using the smallest ones. Uh, I'll leave a description, I mean, sorry, I'll leave a links in the description below. Next, you're going to need a substrate to fill in your net pod. A common substrate medium would be these hydroponics. Uh, pebbles, clay pebbles that I have here. So these are used for all kinds of things, soil aeration, drainage, hydroculture, aquaponics, all kinds of good stuff. They're just made out of clay. Here they are here. Now if you're going to start from seed, you're going to need some rock wool cubes. These are rock wool cubes. They're, uh, I believe they're actually rock spun into wool somehow. It's kind of neat. You're going to take one of these cubes and you want to actually fill it in to your net pod about almost all the way down. Just enough so you can cover it with the pebbles around it. Make sure you always soak these cubes before. I'm going to show you all this in the next video, but to quickly show you, that's how you would insert a rock wool cube. Starting from seed instead of a full plant already grown, uh, you're going to start with these rock wool cubes and insert it into your net pod just like so. All these materials you can get dime a dozen uh, on Amazon is your, probably your best bet or if you have a local uh, grow shop or hydroponic shop, uh, sometimes you can find these things at uh, Canadian Tire or Home Depot. Okay, and uh, that's all you will need to get started on a deep water culture system. In my next video, I'll be showing you how to set up a DWC system on a fish aquarium. So subscribe so you don't miss out. Peace.